traffic from Acadiana, your local news leader. This is KLFY News 10 Morning Rush. The time is now 6.56. Let's get you caught up on today's top stories as you head out the door with the News 10 Morning Rush. Lafayette police are investigating an overnight shooting in the 200 block of Vernon Street that left one male victim dead. Anyone with information on this incident should call police or Lafayette Crime Stoppers. Police in Brobridge are investigating a triple shooting that happened Mardi Gras night. Three people were injured and taken to a hospital. One person was arrested in connection to a shooting that happened on Jean Vier Road in Lafayette Parish. James McMillian is charged with attempted second degree murder and illegal carrying of a weapon. Authorities arrested 18 year old Adante Williams of Patterson on Monday in connection to a shooting on Highway 90 in Berwick. Police are searching for two other suspects. Bishop Douglas Desitel will celebrate an Ash Wednesday Mass later today at the Cathedral of St. John the Evangelist. Ashes will be distributed when the Mass begins at 12.05. King Gabriel's Ball helped wrap up the 2023 Mardi Gras season in Lafayette Tuesday evening. Organizers say tickets are free if you'd like to attend next year. State Representative Foy Gadbury is proposing a new bill that would require Mardi Gras parade organizers to clean up the litter within 24 hours. That bill will be debated during the regular session in April. Good morning, Acadiana. I'm News 10's Richard Cattino. Kaplan and Crawley brought in the Mardi Gras celebration with food, music, and floats. Good morning, Acadiana. This is News 10's Dawson D'Amico. The 32nd annual Papa Red Dog Mardi Gras parade took place in Lauraville as members of the community continued to let the good times roll. It will be a warm and windy Ash Wednesday. I think those winds are going to be gusting 40, 45 miles per hour. That's as strong as a weak tropical storm. So think about that if you have anything kind of loose in your yards that you may need to at least get them out of the wind or any time down if it's a trampoline or something like that. Isolated rain in there for the afternoon. It's already warm and breezy. Those rain chances will come up to about 30% during the second part of the day. All right, Mardi Gras a season is officially Is it over? over? I guess it is, right? I Not mean, I think Mardi so, Gras yeah. Again. Today is like Ash Wednesday I, I, and the Lenten season. I like that story we do where they, you know, the police and I, even the mayor, you know, I they go know. and they sweep the uh, streets at the end. Uh, the one night uh, on Burbage Street where they're like, get out of here. We're, we're done with this. I'm day. questioning <laughs> myself. I, I, <laughs> I know. I'm questioning, though. I don't remember learning about that in the past. I mean, I grew I've, up I've in Homa. But it. Again, I've heard about it, and it's cool to see.